Christmas is coming and so here is an early gift for you. We've tested the five best form builders with conditional logic so you don't have to. Welcome back to the channel and yeah, the clue is in the title. We wanted to find out which of these competitors really stood out from the rest when it came to the world of hiding questions, branching, conditional logic. Look, everyone seems to have their own name for this, but conditional logic, that is what we're going to call it for the duration of this video. There are timestamps listed if you want to skip ahead to a particular competitor, but let's start with this. Why does this video matter? Why do we need to find a good form builder with conditional logic? Well, there are three clear reasons. One, enhanced user experience or UX is the biggest benefit with users filling in fewer fields when only the relevant ones appear, saving them time and leading to much less frustration with the process. We've all been there. Two, increase conversion rates as a knock-on benefit of the enhanced UX conditional logic forms also tend to increase conversion with forms that ask the absolute minimum number of questions. And three higher quality leads. By asking targeted questions based on previous responses in your forms you gather more precise and relevant information. So without any further ado, let's show you the five best form builders with conditional logic on the market. I'm Colin by the way, I've been doing this for a while. Growform is a multi-step form builder that makes it easy to create complex branching forms that maximize conversions. All of Growform's pricing plans offer conditional logic in the form of if-then rules that dynamically show or hide fields and steps based on the user's input. For example, let's say a lead selects fundraiser from this event hosting form. In that case, you can set a conditional rule that only shows those users a follow-up question about the type of charity they represent, rather than showing that irrelevant question to everyone. Growform is packed with features far beyond conditional logic. The builder itself is fully no-code, but for the technically minded, there are advanced customization options like custom CSS. You can also add images and videos, as well as integrate with more than 300 third-party tools tools and apps. As for a nice neat summary of Growform's conditional logic pros and cons, well, on the plus side, the interface, as you can see, is intuitive and easy to use, no code or tech wizardry required whatsoever. They also boost higher conversion rates from personalized and streamlined form experiences with extensive flexibility and customization options with seamless integrations across both the Condi Lodge and the form builder itself. Cons, well, as with many of these form builders, there's going to be an initial learning curve to fully understand all of its conditional logic capabilities. And if you have exceedingly complex forms with extensive conditional logic, this will eat up your time in setup and testing. When it comes to pricing for Growform, this is what it looks like at time of recording. But best of all, Growform offers a free 14-day trial with full functionality so you can test out its conditional logic and all the other features with no credit card required. Next up is WP Forms, a popular WordPress form builder known for its user-friendly drag and drop interface, as you can see here. It enables users to create various types of forms without any coding knowledge, making it ideal for creating engaging, dynamic and conditional forms quickly. WP Forms is specifically designed and optimized for WordPress, so you can be sure it will integrate smoothly. Other pros include that easy to use drag and drop interface, the extensive integrations with email marketing and CRM tools, over a thousand customizable form templates, and a raft of YouTube tutorial videos if you just don't understand how any of their functionality works. Among the cons would include the fact that some advanced features are only available in higher tier plans and limited styling options without custom CSS. The conditional logic feature, while the drag and drop is easy enough, is a little busy on the eyes. There is a lot going on in the page itself. As for pricing, this is what it looks like at time of recording. Everything from basic right through to elite. Formidable Forms, as the name would suggest, is a powerful WordPress form builder designed to easily create complex data-driven forms. It's suitable for advanced users who need more than basic form functionality, offering features like calculations, form templates, and, of course, 
conditional logic. On that feature specifically, Formidable is somewhat comparable to WP Forms with its drag and drop interface. And for anyone familiar with WordPress, you will already feel somewhat at home with its familiar surroundings, as you can see here. It works much like the two competitors we've already discussed with the if-then rules setup. The pros of Formidable would include some of its advanced features, including the calculations and conditional logic, as well as comprehensive library of form templates and customization options. As for the cons, beginners may need time to understand how all of its interface works, and as with a few of these businesses, you will have to pay more to access some of the advanced features. On that pricing note, here is what Formidable offers at time of recording, with the basic a little cheaper than WP Forms. Let's talk about Zoho Forms. The tool offers a form building solution integrated with other Zoho applications like Sheets, CRM, Projects and Desk. This option might be the most convenient for you if you're already a Zoho user or are considering a switch. Let me cut to the chase. Of all the suggestions on this list, I would say personally Zoho Forms has the weakest conditional logic of the five, or field rules as they call it. The interface isn't great, the tutorials you'll need to watch to understand how it works are a little clunky, however, as mentioned, if you are a Zoho Suite user, it may make more sense to follow through with this platform as it does have so many integrations with existing Zoho products. Continuing with the pros, Zoho is among the most affordable form builders on the market today. Here's the pricing as of time of recording, but it also does have detailed analytics and reporting features if you want to take a deep dive on your data. Now we have talked about Jotform on this channel before, but if you're new to it, Jotform is an online form builder known for its ease of use and its absolutely massive template library. It supports a wide range of integrations and features, including conditional logic, making it a versatile choice for businesses. Focusing on the conditional logic, or conditions as Jotform calls it, it can be a bit overwhelming at first due to the sheer list of options it offers. However, setting it up is straightforward enough and can be used to ensure a smoother, more streamlined user experience. As for pros and cons, an extensive free tier with many features is available on Jotform, as well as easy integration with a wide range of third-party tools. On the negative side, you do have limited submissions and storage on lower tier plans, and as mentioned, the interface can be overwhelming at times due to simply how much they offer. When it comes to pricing, just copy and paste what I've said about everybody else on the list. Here's what it looks like. A range of options to suit every single person. And that is it. Those are the five best form builders with conditional logic on the market today. If you've enjoyed this video, if you found it useful, what would be really useful for me is letting me know in the comments that really validates my existence. And if you're yet to like this video or subscribe to this channel, we're so close to the 100 mark, be sure to go and do that before you go. I trust that you are now armed with all the information you need, but if you do have any outstanding questions, the comments is where to be. So let us know what you would like us to look at next. Until next time, have fun out there, and I'll see you again soon.